sports facilities are phenomenal. I've seen teams here that I hope as chairman of the British Olympic Association are going to find their way into Team GB uh, in years to come. The thought and tension that you put on sport is lovely to be somewhere where sport is not tucked away at the edge of the curriculum but is sort of the mainstay front and centre in the lives of, uh, of students. How much does your time at university sort of affect you in later life, do you think? Oh, I think we're all, you know, it's a large part of the experience, isn't it? Um, I think it's, you know, it's for most of us, it's the first time we sort of genuinely leave home. It's, it's a building that uses natural light very nicely. You know, any building, as I've said, that has sport sitting at the middle is, is great. And it, it is, it's a, it's a building that would attract you in. And I, I like the way, for instance, in, in sort of the administrative hub and some of the student welfare areas where there's the opportunity to, you know, clearly to have discreet and private conversations with counsellors. But at the same time, it, you're not sort of tucked away in, in little boxes, that are, you know, with doors that are opening and closing all the time. What do you think the legacy can be? For this place, like well, you talk about legacy a lot, and you're obviously in charge of the Olympics. So. Well, I think legacy is whatever you want it to be, isn't it? But it's ultimately what you want out of it. I don't think you can sit at the centre and say that's what your legacy must be any more than you can sit at the centre of a city and say our legacy is definitely going to be this, you know, rather than that. I think it's what communities gravitate towards, and it's what's instinctive. So. What, what is the legacy of this university and that this building? Clearly sport is important, clearly the opportunity to mix and integrate. Seb, in your Olympic speech you talked about inspiring a generation. Do you think this building can do the same thing now for young people coming here? Well, from what I've seen today, it's already doing it. You know, I know that I'm, I, I do tend to wander around you know, sites unseen where effort is made to make sure they look like they're being used. But I didn't get that feeling today. You know, you know, I walk in at midday and virtually every piece of equipment is being used and there are people waiting to get onto the equipment and, you know, core stability classes and cheerleading and table tennis. No, I, I, I think that's clearly already happening.